My first encounter in mathematics was uh, at the beginning of the high school. Uh, I realized that uh, the, the problems, the mathematical problems that at that time were quite hard, um, were really challenges for me. And then, uh, so I, I remember very well uh, the situation of, uh, of being in, uh, in, uh, in an office uh, at home that was shared by all the members of the family and then uh, having the pleasure of uh, uh, finishing the problems, so solving problems. Uh, and I also like it very much, uh, so connections between uh, uh, geometry and analysis, so how to understand geometric properties in terms of, uh, well, what, what later on I call analysis, at that time were just computations. So uh, I, I, w I was only 52, and uh, at that time uh, uh, the situation in Spain was, uh, was really very hard. Uh, I would say it still is, <laughs> but uh, well, we have improved <laughs> nevertheless. So um, my parents didn't have a, a, a university uh, um, degree, but nevertheless uh, they have a, a broad culture. Uh, so. That means that conversations at home uh, were, um, I think, of a uh, quite good level. And there were books at home, and uh, we are used to, to read and to buy the newspaper and, 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 and all that. Um, at home, uh, so my, my, my father was, uh, uh, have been politically very involved, um, but uh, at that time, because of the difficulties, um, we didn't talk uh, very much about politics because uh, I suppose that they were afraid that uh, you know at the school or, or wherever we we comment about uh, something and that uh, the family could be persecuted. So um, I remember that uh, my 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 father was still very interested in politics, and I remember, for example, in connection with France uh, during the the uh, Algerian War. So uh, he went every evening after, after when he came back from, from his work uh, to buy a newspaper. But that time was, was uh, you know, uh, it was not uh, very easy. So he went to have the, the night newspaper in order to follow everything. Um, <coughs> but um, when, when I went at the university, so then, uh, really, the, the environment was, uh, was uh, very, very political. So um, at home, much less, although it was Latin, because, uh, uh, but at the university, yeah, very much. It was not a click, it was not a click. So, well, first I, uh, I started, I started the first year at the university. At, at that time, um, uh, so it was uh, common for, for uh, scientific fields, so for mathematics, physics, uh, biology, geology, and uh, chemistry. And uh, I hesitated very much between mathematics and physics. So uh, I took a branch of more, more um, mathematical oriented. Um, but um, then I, I thought, okay, so maybe let's postpone the decision and I, I will do both degrees at the, the same time. <laughs> but <laughs> then, uh, you know, I, I realized that uh, this was really very hard and that I couldn't make it. Uh, so I decided, I decided uh, mathematics. But um, that was more like a background. So at that time, I, I didn't know really what the profession of a, of a mathematician could be. So uh, I liked mathematics, I liked the connection with philosophy, the, the, the abstraction, the relation with music. I play piano, so uh, it was uh, also a way. I like it very much, or I like still uh, poetry. So all this abstract thinking and, and science and, and humanities, uh, I, I, I was very interested in. So I, I think that uh, 
the, the uh, choosing mathematics as a profession uh, came really very gradually. So um, my field of expertise is uh, probability, uh, probability theory. Uh, so that means the, the, the field of mathematics with, with, uh, deals with randomness. And uh, uh, I, am <coughs> I am working on, uh, on a branch of uh, probability, uh, which is called uh, stochastic analysis. And um, a part of, uh, of uh, this area is devoted to uh, study, well, to construct and to study, so to, 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 to present, to study um, models uh, uh, of uh, phenomena of uh, real life uh, in, in which uh, uh, randomness uh, should be considered because um, either because there is not enough knowledge of uh, uh, all th all the the ingredients that uh, uh, that uh, are present in in uh, in this uh, phenomena or um, just because of uh, yeah because you don't know what is happening so you see okay so this is uh, this is uh, uh, random um, so uh, I, I felt very much attracted uh, by this topic uh, uh, for, for uh, uh, the reason I said, I said, I told you before, so the connections with philosophy. Um, because, well, in, in some sense, so um, the fact that uh, the, the, the randomness uh, could be could be uh, uh, studied mathematically and, and uh, given a theory and, uh, and, and giving a model. Um, the the uh, how to say so the mystery of uh, randomness disappear, and uh, I I I felt attracted to to to, un to understand so this uh, this kind of transition from the unknown and, and random to something that you can control with your uh, computations. I think so. Yes, I, I think so. Um, so uh, gradually, not when I was a student, but um, gradually with, uh, uh, with the age, with, uh, I, I became very much interested also in, um, in architecture for example, which of course has also connections with mathematics, with uh, you know, dealing, dealing with uh, the, the space uh, nicely and also all the, all the technical part. Um, I would say that I feel interested in challenges. So uh, when, when people ask me why I choose mathematics, um, I think that the, 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 so the reason was because I, I felt that there were, they were important challenges there. So maybe maybe I, I could have chosen, I don't know, I like a lot of music. So for example, uh, at some point I thought, uh, what a beautiful life to be the conductor of an orchestra. <laughs> I cannot say that uh, I, I had, uh, I suppose that you are asking for, for some professors or for, uh, I, I was not very much, um, so to say, satisfied, uh, not with the with the level of the, the background that uh, they they provide to us. So I think that the, the lectures were were really um, nice and high level, but uh, it was not an enthusiastic environment. And uh, I, I I noticed a, a big difference between uh, the the way uh, the way the lectures were were given and uh, all the performances uh, at that time and the effort that we now do with our students. Uh, so um, I don't blame anybody. I, I think that uh, it owns to the to the to the difficult situation where uh, so uh, my my professors. Mm, went uh, went to some conferences, but uh, but uh, not very often. Uh, and now we are we are you know going uh, here and there uh, every month and uh, well as much as uh, we wish uh, we wish except for uh, or of course we have to teach and then we have less mobility. But uh, at that time it was really so. They say, oh yeah, yeah so uh, he did his PhD in Germany. He went then once uh, uh, to Göttingen or something like that. that, that. So uh, it was really uh, really very gray gray color. And uh, 
I, I think that they did a very good job in the sense that uh, they, they really kept updated with the progress of mathematics, um, you know, reading books and, and so on, but, but the enthusiasm in transferring this knowledge to us, uh, I would say it was not exceptional. Uh, of course, they, they, they were small Eurekas in uh, small problems already in the, in, the, in the PhD thesis, of course, and then, then I remember that, uh, uh, so I, uh, when I finished my PhD, after a few years, I, I published alone uh, uh, an article in Danos of Probability, which is a very good journal, and I was very proud of uh, having done that alone without my PhD advisor or, or uh, collaborators. So th then uh, I found this Eureka that, uh, that you say, although the, the result is nothing very, very exceptional, it's good, but not, not very exceptional. So uh, th this came later, this came re re really later uh, when um, I, I, I went in, into stochastic partial differential equations, which is the uh, topic I am working since since many years. And then um, and I, I remember, I remember uh, to to to. to so suddenly having in, 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 in my brain some ideas that, uh, that I, I elaborated more and more and more and then uh, eventually it, it was, you know, uh, the, the, some, the spark that, uh, that uh, produced uh, the, the, the result. So, and, and then, of course, uh, um, later on they came more and more uh, uh, frequently and, and then maybe you, you don't give so much importance to, to the fact that you, you have created something. It depends very much. Um, I, I am not used to, to work with, uh, with large teams. But uh, um, um, this is uh, something that in mathematics um, is, is quite uh, recent. So most of the uh, mathematicians of my age so, um, were more or less used to, to work with two, three people um, in, a, in, a, in a given subject. Okay? So now things are changing, so uh, um, groups are m much, much bigger. So I, I prefer to, to work with few people and sometimes also alone, but not for a long time, not for a long time, because uh, uh, this is very hard and there is also a psychological um, issue here. So when you get uh, disappointed, so um, it's, it's, it's hard to, uh, to, to, you know, to become an enthusiastic about the, about the, the problem uh, uh, again uh, by yourself. So I think that it's, a, it, it's very good to interact with people. Um, you give to them something, but probably you receive more than you give. And uh, so the, the, the balance is always positive, uh, uh, I think. So that's my experience. So um, I, I didn't experience uh, discrimination. Um, in a, in, a, in in the, in a very so to say clear way, so uh, perhaps is 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 uh, it was hidden in some behaviors, but uh, my perception is that uh, the cases that well I noticed that something was wrong uh, was more due to personalities that uh, than to the environment. Um, <coughs> I, I found, in, not only locally, but especially locally, so in my university, um, I, I felt always um, very, very well treated. And, uh, um, so I, I, was, uh, I was elected dean of the faculty uh, when I was 45. Uh, which was uh, uh, very unconscious from my, my side, I think. Uh, but nevertheless, the, the, this, this was really like a school, so I learned, I learned a lot. And uh, uh, at that time, uh, the, the, the colleagues, and, and, and the, especially so the, 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 the people that uh, were in, in, the, in the group of, uh, of uh, directors, so to say, so the dean, the vice dean, the secretary, and so on, they, they helped me a lot, and we built a, a, a strong team. 
and uh, well, I was the first woman being being a dean of of the faculty. So uh, then also uh, concerning the mathematical uh, career, um, I, I well I, I collaborated much more with uh, with uh, males than, than with uh, the females. It is for sure because well the, the, this is the the, the society, uh, the mathematical society, the composition of the mathematical the mathematical community uh, has this uh, bias, and I, I always felt like uh, one more in, in in the team. But I think that uh, we are we are really um, so to say. Uh, like a bubble in the society, because well, in principle, at least in, in our country, like in France, so as professors we are we are civil servants, and then there is no difference. So uh, there is no difference in the salary, for example, something which happens if you work in a bank or in a in a in a private comp company. So. Um, in in this in this respect, I, I didn't found barriers. So the, the, the barriers were or are more outside uh, the, the academia. This is my, my personal experience. So outside you feel barriers. So you feel social barriers in, in your environment. So I mean uh, your, your family in, in, in an extended sense, uh, uh, your friends uh, many times. And yeah, uh, the society in general, okay? Because when you when you uh, explain to people that you are a mathematician and what do you do? So I do the maths uh, in order that you know this building <laughs> that does not collapse until I, it's the only way that uh, you have to explain what you are doing. And then, uh, well, most of the time uh, people say, okay, so now you are on vacation because uh, your kids are on vacation. No, no, I go uh, I go every day. And what do you do? So I do research. And what is research and so it's very difficult to explain and this this creates somehow a, a, a barrier in the sense of um, um, understanding of uh, uh, you know uh, um, uh, well yeah explaining what you are doing and, and being acknowledged as uh, uh, for your work so more, more outside that inside. Uh, partially yes and partially not. Um, so uh, of course I am aware of the problem and, uh, and uh, I, I think that there is a, an issue there, not only maths but in, uh, spe specifically in maths. So um, I, uh, I, uh, as you know, I have been the president of, uh, of the European Mathematical Society and there I, I really did my best to, to improve the situation uh, through, through the, the, the committee uh, woman of, of, of mathematics, but it was more not not inside the committee because I was not a member of the committee, but uh, trying to implement uh, actions and, and to to give more room to 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 the well to the problems and to uh, initiatives uh, etc. Uh, that uh, were were presented by by the group of women. Uh, on the other hand, um, so. The, the, this, this kind of organizations, um, uh, of course, they are doing an excellent job, so it's not something that should be criticized. But uh, my, my personal point of view is uh, that um, sometimes this idea of uh, doing um, things, uh, uh, women together, and only women, for example, these uh, conferences, where um, I don't feel comfortable with that because um, uh, if, uh, if um, we have to be more visible, um, so uh, uh, there is not a, not a good idea uh, to, uh, to, 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 to be in a room only with women, you know, and talking, talking to each other, so what theorem have you proved? And well, uh, I think that this is not a good idea. Um, uh, I find a, a, much better, a much better strategy to um, when you, you, you are in a committee or you have, you have the possibility, or even if you are not in a committee, so to, to, to strive and, and, and to fight for, for uh, um, uh, gender um, equivalence, so in committees, etc., etc. But on the other hand, there is also, there is also this, uh, this question about quotas. This I, I, I don't like uh, either, because uh, 
uh, you know, if uh, if we have to to be part of committees or of uh, boards uh, because we are females, uh, I think that we are uh, automatic or not automatically, but in most of the cases, a bit devaluated. And um, um, and now um, I I have some concerns about uh, the uh, the way you know the the force that uh, is, is coming uh, everywhere, saying, okay, so this committee should uh, consist of uh, two and two. And then you have to find the, you have to find the right person. But all, all, always uh, uh, um, uh, having in mind that the best solution will be two and two. And, uh, and my experience is that uh, if you take a, a deep thought of that and you spend time, uh, in general, you solve this problem. So. Um, not always, but uh, many times. So it, it's a matter of working hard on the problem. Yeah, so um, I, I like to, to be um, active in uh, the very many aspects of the profession of a scientist. Uh, in particular, well, I am a mathematician. So, um, of course, um, the, the most part of, your, of uh, our time, uh, uh, we, we do research, we are teaching, uh, we interact with uh, our PhD students or with your students in general. So, they, they, this is the, so one part of the profession. But then the, there is, for example, uh, all, all this aspect of networking, uh, where um, mathematical societies are so important. And, uh, and uh, this network is important at the local level, is, 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 is uh, important at the national level, is uh, um, more important at the European level, at the worldwide level. So um, uh, this is why I, I, I felt very much uh, attracted to, to be an active part of that and also uh, in the academies and so work that is not, uh, not exactly to sit down uh, in uh, your office and, and to prove, uh, uh, to prove uh, theorems. So then of course when you, you, you show some availability uh, for for this kind of job, since since uh, there are not that so many people that uh, uh, that uh, like to to do to do the, this uh, this kind of task, um, so that you you are asked uh, uh, many 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 times and at many places. And um, well, uh, you have to be careful because uh, of course you have to cope with that and uh, and do that uh, uh, properly. So it's true that uh, now I am in, in, in many in, in many boards, and but uh, uh, this came also as a consequence uh, of uh, of my presidency or the, of the my, my office at the uh, at the EMS because uh, I was visible, you know, I was uh, in a showcase for 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 a while. And on the other hand, I think that is also something that uh, that um, comes naturally uh, with um, with age, with aging. Okay, so uh, you have more experience. Uh, so there are positive and negative parts of uh, of uh, uh, in aging. So um, you have more, more experience, so you can you can give your uh, and uh, deliver your your opinions and uh, and share uh, your your experiences with others. So then uh, it's a, I think that it's a, something natural. <laughs> Yeah, th th that's a, that's a very good uh, a very good uh, question because uh, in fact uh, I, uh, I I visited the CIRM for the first time in my life uh, maybe in eighty two or eighty three, uh, so uh, it, it it was quite different it was quite different but uh, nevertheless I, I was impressed so already at that time and this is because the mathematical community in France is very strong. And so, uh, of course, <coughs> the organization of, uh, at that time was, was not as large and, and, and maybe not so well structured uh, as, as it is now, but already the scene play a very, very important, uh, important role. Uh, I remember uh, to, to have come every year because uh, the scene hosted in, the, in, in September the Seminaire de Probabilité. 
And uh, this was uh, something really, you know, very, very important for probability in France and I, I would say in, in the world. So it was Emery or, uh, I don't know, many, many of those people that, are, well, some of them have disappeared, unfortunately, and some others are, are, are already retired. Uh, so then uh, I, have, I have followed as a scientist the evolution. So now, of course, th there have been a, a drastic change. A drastic change, um, uh, probably uh, because because uh, well, Europe has changed. Okay, in the, in the uh, well, uh, hopefully in the in the in the good uh, in the direction. Um, so I, I really think that CIRM uh, uh, now is uh, uh, it already was, but now more and more uh, um, a crucial center and uh, of crucial importance uh, for mathematics uh, in, in Europe. And something that um, I noticed, uh, um, being member of the of, of the board, uh, was um, so this um, uh, the, the the efforts uh, to become um, much more uh, international. So as I said, so the, the, the local uh, the French mathematical community is already very strong, but uh, maybe uh, several years ago, so most of the participants, uh, so a big proportion of participants in the activities of CIRM uh, were uh, French, and uh, uh, this, ha this has changed a lot. This has changed a, a, a lot. And now I suppose that with, uh, with, uh, with extension, uh, the, well, the CIRM will, will start really a, a, new, a new and very, very prosperous and a nice period. So uh, I have been really impressed by, by the work of the directors, and especially Patrick. And yeah, so it's a very good situation, the CIRM now. Yeah, yeah, I like very much. So, yeah, I th uh, it has been a, a, a very good idea to preserve La Bastida because, uh, well, this is like a symbol. This, this is the building that I have, I met for the first time. Uh, and uh, uh, I, I like, the, I like the, the, the new building very much. So um, this is this, uh, this uh, difference between uh, new and old style. Uh, in comparison with La Bastida, but uh, it it um, it's very, it has a lot of respect uh, uh, with the with the environment, so I, I really like it. Yeah.